Hey everyone, I'm back with another tutorial. Today, it's lettuce and what happens when it gets hot and it wants to go to seed. And this is the first thing that you get and that is called your lettuce bolting. I have <clears throat> two different varieties of lettuce planted right here. I have some flowers on this lettuce. If you want to uh, attempt to let your lettuce naturally reseed, just let it continue to go. After the flowering has happened, you will get seed pods. Uh, they will kind of resemble in one way um, a green bean but on a very miniature scale to a green bean. And uh, what will happen is they will dry, and when they dry, they fall to the ground. And then come the next season that they can grow, you will have a bunch of lettuce come up. And this is a lettuce that I planted this spring. I just wanna let you have a really good overlook. I have lettuce currently started in seed trays. I uh, reside in Pennsylvania, so if you want to do fall crops, right now is the time to start your seeds in seed trays. You're actually a little late, but get your lettuce, get your kale, get your uh, broccoli, your cauliflower, your greens, that kind of thing. Get them started now because next month you need to transplant them into your garden. <clears throat> so, just let the um, lettuce continue to do what it's doing. You don't need to do anything with it except make sure that it gets watered and it just rained here. So the water is actually fantastic. I mean, look at that. You can actually still see the water drops. Okay, let me give you just some close-ups of what this will look like before the lettuce um, does the actual flowering. You're looking at the lettuce buds right now. Normally, uh, a leaf like this it has a little bad spot. I would nip it off, but uh, when your lettuce bolts, it's going to be bitter, so you're not really going to eat it anyway because it's going to taste really bitter. So I'm just going to leave it. And uh, I'm just going to watch the lettuce, make sure that it stays nice and healthy, and that will be it. Uh, some growing tips on lettuce. Lettuce loves water. Lettuce will live below a freezing temperature. It will survive a frost. However, uh, December of last year, we had a real cold snap and it actually killed my lettuce that was in a greenhouse. Uh, but it was uh, probably in the teens with 30 and 40 mile per hour winds. So it got really cold in the greenhouse and I think um, lettuce can survive up to somewhere in the low 20 degrees mark. Uh, it might actually be a little higher. It might be the upper 20s. <coughs> Are you done barking? Thank you. Okay, so keep it watered. It will do its own thing. And this fall, you will have an awesome amount of lettuce come up without you having to lift a finger to plant your lettuce. So enjoy. And until next time, I'm back with a tutorial. Have fun in your garden. And if you haven't started a garden yet, watch the videos, start to get a little bit knowledgeable because it's never too late to start a garden. When I started this garden, it was only the size of my strawberry plants and that's not a big area. It's maybe 12 by 12 and it was strawberries and tomatoes the first year in the garden. And I've done lots of expanding on this garden and this garden is growing to be big. 
So, new gardeners, this is a place for you because everybody needs to start their garden somewhere. And I will go more into depth in another video on a generalized care routine that I do for my garden that will help you. All right, I gotta go.